building bridges between the English and Spanish language. It allows teachers, students, parents, and community members to come together under one roof to weave together the English and Spanish language. We've done group activities with the Hokey Pokey in Spanish and English. We've done fun hand games. We've read bilingual books um, songs. and songs. We've done some songs. Just stuff to get people relaxed and enjoy each other and get to know each other. Regina McDonald with the Kershaw County School District and Lydia Carnesale with the State Department of Education are in charge of the event. It's helping Spanish-speaking parents learn English just like their children in school and others in the community learn Spanish. And then after that we split up into two groups so that we are giving a um, learning time for parents so that they can develop their English language skills and then the learning time for their children and their teachers um, so they can develop an academic language and literacy skill in Spanish and connect it back to English. For Canasale as a Latina woman, she says it means so much more than learning to these families but also opening more doors for them. And here the ability and the drive of these parents to be present and learn both skill sets for the betterment of their child, it makes me proud. Um, Two-thirds of the world is bilingual, so they can go anywhere and relate, communicate, and build as individuals. It's, it's beautiful. They add that they hope to see the program expand into other districts and to also grow within Kershaw County. For Street Squad in Kershaw County, I'm Walker Lawson.